Hello and welcome back everyone. Yeah, <laughs> hi again. This is kind of an odd video. It's the first time I'm filming um, like a video with my iPhone camera, which I've seriously, I've like never done it before. So I'm really hoping <laughs> it'll be okay. I used to take out a DSLR camera from my school's like resource center to film these videos, TVH. But since I haven't been going to campus this semester, I just don't really want to go all the way downtown on a train and on a bus for a camera. All things considered, since it is downtown Chicago. <laughs> but anyway, um, I do hope this video will still be nice and look good. I'm really hoping. I Sorry, y'all. I'll try my best to make sure everything is in focus and looks good, but I just wanted to do a disclaimer because I really, this is like my first experience with this. Anyway, I am seriously so excited to open up things today because First of all, as you can see here, we've got our Luna light stick, Hilario Sonia. <laughs> I hope I said that right, but um, yeah, I'm super pumped. Um, I'll tell y'all about how I got this later. I also have Rebelbit's fan club kit that just got here yesterday, and then a few other goodies that I'm really dying to like open up and see what is inside of. So yeah, let's get started. The first thing I want to open today is this letter. I am seriously pretty sure what is inside of here and I am kind of freaking out at it. So let me open it real quick. Oh my god, y'all. Y'all. <laughs> so um, Ryan sent a message saying thank you so much for buying from me. I hope the Gawans arrive safely. So your girl after months and months of searching your girl has finally 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 gotten the last two go on album cards that i was missing i have both of her xx butterfly era cards <laughs> I am so happy! These are literally the last two album cards I needed of hers, including the um, the group cards because I do collect group um, album cards for her. So can you believe? I now have all of the cards for her pre-debut, all of the cards for Hi Hi, um, <laughs> at least photo cards, all of the photo cards for XX, and all of the ca photo cards for hashtag. But I am so happy! She is so cute. These cards are just so difficult to come across. And Butterfly is honestly just such a beautiful era. I really wanted to have these cards for such a long time. But finally, this person was like selling their collection, so I like jumped on it and I was like, please, <laughs> it's the last ones I need, which will be great because I. Uh, I should be filming my binder tour finally after a million years super soon after a specific package gets here So I'm just waiting on that, but it will be really nice to have like my collection Completed at least for album cards and I am so happy. She looks so cute in both of these cards What a precious baby. I love their outfits in this era and her styling was just beautiful. She looked great so the next thing I have is this pin. It is coming from Hong Kong. I'll be real, I have no clue what this pin is. I have no memory of it. When it got here, I saw that it said like pin in the customs part and I was like, what? <laughs> what pin did I order from Hong Kong recently? I have no memory of this. Oh my God. <gasps> I forgot entirely about this. Yes. Oh my god. Oh, this is such a nice thing to get all of a sudden. I can't believe I forgot entirely. I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy right now. I'm feeling the joy. Okay, y'all. As we have discussed many a times on this channel, I love the Red Room like concert series. I love every design for it. I like I just think it was a feat of creative <laughs> direction that only comes by once in a rare moon. And 
Y'all know I've been collecting red velvet pins pretty intensely for a while. During the Red Room era, they released um, a pin for each girl. Um, even, but it's not like a pin that like necessarily looks like them. They were like these little creative like little characters that they made of each girl. Um, and <laughs> I've only been able to find Joy and Yeti's pins, um, which I do have on my pin board already. But Irene, Silky, and Wendy have taken me a while to find. I feel like even on Banchang, I see a lot of people like as like posting want to buy posts for these pins so i don't know i don't know where the hell they've gone <laughs> i'm only missing like a heart one and then like three girls but the one i got today is irene's <laughs> which i'm kind of freaking out about look at that it is a uh, irene's pin for red room holy shit. uh how did I forget I was getting this? I forgot entirely, like absolutely no memory of this. <laughs> wow, what a great surprise from past me to future me. Thank you, Maria. <laughs> Next up is this package. I'm almost sure what it is and it's not for me, but I will have to open it anyway. So, um, I Oh, nice! So I am helping a friend of mine right now and I am receiving some of their packages. So this is not mine, this is their purchase. Oh, freaky ad. <laughs> not ad, um, freebie. So I think that what they got... <laughs> it's so sweet. Oh wait! Oh wait, no! Y'all! <laughs> this is not it, this is mine! <laughs> This is absolutely mine. Holy sh Okay, wait. <laughs> this is not my friends. This is absolutely my stuff. Okay. <laughs> this is so funny. I did not expect that. And I was even here like, damn, I want that rookie freebie, but like obviously it wasn't mine. So with the recent um, Red Velvet like Trolls merch that's been coming out, Asen decided to release like a photo card with every $30 she spent at the event. So it's like f four different sets of photo cards. Yeah, they released a ton of cards, including early era cards, which like y'all know, I'm obsessed with like Red Velvet's early Red Eras, like, you know, Rookie, Russian Roulette, <laughs> Dum Dum, like all of that was amazing to me and it's a lot of the reason why I started standing Red Velvet. Oh, hi, Frida. She wants attention. <laughs> but basically, I decided to collect a full set of the first two sets, which were one for Russian Roulette, one for Dum Dum, just because there is such few merch for these eras and they're my favorite and I just want to have the cards for them. <laughs> so um, what we got got is three of these cards um i got two of solgi's um trolls cards basically so for the one for dum dum the one for russian roulette i really love this card she looks so pretty in it and then irene's russian roulette card which is perfect these were so cheap this is some great music i believe like put them up for like a really good price honestly i paid almost nothing for these this is such a good like lucky thing to have stumbled across and the person sent me a rookie freebie you are amazing thank you so much i love rookie freebies and they sent a message saying thank you so much for joining my group order i hope your cards have arrived safely please let me know when you get this Gion stars ps i love your videos thank you so much for watching <laughs> and for sending me these cards they arrived in perfect condition this makes me so happy thank you Okay, next up is this envelope. I'm gonna guess this is the one that has my friend's stuff. Yes, okay, this is my friend's items. They got um, Selgi's Hollow Sandy. I think this was from Great Music. I will store this safely and ship it to them later on. But it's really cute, right? It's so weird not, not to be getting most goods from Monster. I'm like still debating whether I should get the 4x6 photos and postcards high key, but we shall see. Anyway, this is really cute. All right, next up, this is so exciting. It is Luna's light stick. I actually ordered it with a friend who's always very kind to me. And they even sent me like, I already read through this because I had to, but like they sent me this really cute letter and they actually <laughs> gave me like these like Saturday MMT cards with my like 
<laughs> light stick and I was like, oh my god, you really did not have to. They're so cute. I don't necessarily stand Saturday, but I do like their music. And this photo is so cute because she's wearing like an Esther Kim like outfit. I love Esther Kim. I have a little like doll of her right over there. But they're such cute cards. Thank you so much for this. I will treasure these um, and they sent me some cute like cat stickers and such so yeah this person was super sweet they also live in Chicago and were like totally willing to meet up with me um, so I didn't have to pay like a lot of shipping for this thank god uh, it like worked out for both of us but <laughs> let's open this I'm kind of freaking out wait should I show the bag this is the bag just in case but um oh <laughs> I'm super pumped this light stick is so freaking massive <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it's so pretty. Um, <laughs> where's, the, where's the bottom part? Wait, okay. Ah! <laughs> okay, it's right here, I guess. Wait. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like, this is messy. This is real messy right now. Real messy hours. Oh my god. Oh, when we finally learned Luna Slice Stick was gonna become a thing, I was so happy. <gasps> it's so pretty. Wait, wait. I need it. I need it. Let me set it up. Let me set it up. <gasps> Oh my god, I actually <laughs> bought batteries on the way back from picking it up so I could make sure to put them on <laughs> for this. I really want to see it light up. <laughs> I feel like a kid, like, I, it just literally feels like a toy. <laughs> but like, <laughs> like, yeah, this is my scepter. I'm a princess. But, <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> okay, wait, does it turn on? Wait, it's not turning on. What did I do wrong? Wait, wait, <laughs> one second. Oh no, I think I did put them on the wrong way. I'm so dumb. Y'all shouldn't trust me. Okay, maybe it'll work now, hopefully. <laughs> I <gotta>. Yes, <laughs> it works. Okay, wait, it doesn't even fit like on the whole image. Oh my God. Look at her. <gasps> okay, so I know it goes through the colors, so. Oh, wait. <laughs> also that. Soft glowing up. And then, okay. Heejin. Hyunjin. Hassel. Yojin. Vivi. Kim Lip. Jinsil. <laughs> Cherry. Eve. <laughs> Chu. And Gwan! <laughs> this is Gwan's color, my queen. And then Olivia Hay. Oh my god, it's so pretty though. It honestly really does feel like a big old staff. Like if during the <laughs> if during the Luna mosh pit, someone comes at you and is trying to cut in your place and get to the front area, you can just give them a good old whack. <laughs> and just like tell them to back the fuck off. <laughs> this is seriously a weapon. It's really pretty though, I have to say. Let me like try to bring it in closer so you see the details but it's definitely kind of huge um <laughs> it's kind of beautiful though and i love the little moon on top oh it's a silicone moon oh nice that way it'll be less able to like easily break basically thank you so much everyone for helping me get this i am so happy so so happy this diamond inside of like the crown really works with like the colors oh wait i want to go back to go once <laughs> i feel like i have a toy this is literally a toy Oh my god, so cute! Okay, it's flat lace time with Go One's color. <laughs> so cool. So, this last package is um, my fan club kit for Red Velvet's Ace fan club membership. I am very excited about this, but also disappointed with some things because I already know what's inside of it. But um, I will be opening this off camera because I don't know if y'all remember last year's year one <laughs> year one disaster, but your girl like I'll just insert a clip. <laughs> okay, I believe I have to cover my name. Yes. Okay. All right. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh, y'all fucking stupid. I cut through the. I cut through the box for the fan club. <laughs> F stupid. Yeah, it was bad. We're not doing that again. So I'm gonna 
carefully open this off camera so you don't see the address, but I also don't murder my package. Uh, <laughs> sorry, y'all. Opening this thing up. Oh, I have to remember not to show y'all my ID either because I had to blur that out last year too now that I remember it. So this is the fan club kit as it opens. This thing seems to be attached to this. This is what the cart looks like. The information is right under here, so obviously I won't be showing you my personal info, but this is the new membership card, which is cute because now I'm gonna have both. I'll have them up as my business cards or whatever. <laughs> but they did make a new logo for this year. I know some fans aren't feeling it. I honestly like it. I think it's cute. I'm not. I'm, I'm honestly not complaining about that. I really like that, like Red Velvet's color, the pastel salmon color. Um, looks really good with like the gold accents. So this is so pretty. Okay, so this is the box for it. Much smaller than last year's. So pretty, honestly. I think it's very cute. And then it opens up through the side like a little drawer. 2020 membership. Okay. First of all, I'm gonna show y'all the pins because I'm really pumped to look at it too. This is of course going in my pin board, but this is a pin. Last year we didn't really get one, so really happy to get a fan club pin this time. This is so cool. There is this thing, it says Red Velvet Special Card. So let's open it up. Cute! Another! <gasps> cool! Welcome to the Revelove. This card is Red Velvet's special card for Revelove members. Thank you for always supporting Red Velvet. This will not be reissued when lost or stolen. Uh, please use this Revelove membership card to participate in the official fan service. Oh, so I, I, don't, I don't know which card you're supposed to use now, but... And then Red Velvet's signature on the back, which is kind of funny, but cool. <laughs> Signed to Revelove. This is so funny. Okay, I guess we get two special cards. I'll take it. <laughs> that was very unexpected, honestly. <laughs> Why did we get two cards this time? I feel like that's gonna be the theme in this package, isn't it? So then we have an envelope with ugh, the fan club like postal stamp again that I really wish was a little sticker set. This one, what is this? Oh, it's just like a card basically with a little message from every girl. That's all right. I wish I could read Hangle and actually get something out of this, but okay. <laughs> Not getting much. Okay, this is the part that I guess annoys me from this is that y'all, season's greetings photos tend to be cute, but it's like we get a whole ass box of season's greetings goods like a calendar, like three, no, like three different types of calendars and like photo cards and pre-order goods. And like TBH, I don't really care like to get more pics of season's greetings things. Like it's the most boring thing to get a, more photos of, honestly, because we already got so much merch of that. Like I get that like they couldn't take new photos for the fan club because like Wendy and she hadn't like officially uh, made her come back to the public which happened super recently, so I can understand that like they didn't have time to take photos, print them, get them in these things and like time for this fan club membership to sh get shipped out, but but <laughs> why these photos, man? I wish we would have gotten like behind the scenes, like era photos, like those cool photos they get taken during like when they're filming the music videos for comebacks and stuff like that, like I would have loved selfies, I would have loved anything else except this but that's okay that's okay I'll, I'll enjoy it I still like it and I still think they look good but they're basically a set of like postcards and these are a little this is pretty thick and honestly pretty nice quality so this is Irene's Yeti Joy Wendy and Silky this is definitely <laughs> the lesbian power of vibes um a concept photo shoot <laughs> and i will always be grateful for that but okay so next there's this like what are you is this, is this like oh my god wait this is cute <gasps> wait okay and I, I love that they use like give you um <laughs> what are these things called again um whatever like hooks for it 
This is so cute. I'm definitely gonna iron this and put it up. Would have would have loved some sewn borders. I mean, I don't, I don't think it'll fray unless you're like playing with it. But I would have liked it to have a finished edge like over here. But you know, all right, <laughs> all right, cheap goods. But it's still pretty cute, and I like that it says Revel Up. So I might still put it up because you know me. Um, <laughs> and then okay, and then last but not least is this little package with the photo card set. This was kind of a really funny choice too, so you will see. So, we got two sets of each photo card <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> this is so confusing. I don't know why some didn't just give us two photos. <laughs> Basically, um, these skirts are still pretty though. I, I'm not gonna complain too much, but <laughs> this is Irene's photo card for the fan club kit. And there's like two different bags for them. So this, these ones have the red velvet logo, the new logo in the back. So it's cute. Then Joy, who looks super cute in this. I love the filter she has on. Oh, Joy again. Oh, are there different photos? Wait. I'm confused. Why are there three Joy photos? What's going on? I think we're getting into a weird area here. What is happening? Oh my f***ing god, that's not Joy. Oh my f***ing god. Oh my god. That's Yeti, y'all. <laughs> what the f*** is wrong with me? Someone take this membership back. I do not deserve <laughs> Fuck, this is obviously Yeti. Okay. Anyway, this, that, this is the end of this channel. I cannot show my face after this embarrassment. I'm going undercover. No one will know of me until 20 years from now. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> oh. This is Yeti's card, not Joy's. Um, she looks super cute in it. This is Joy's though, for sure. Wow, the confusion. Then Silgi's card, which is really cute, but like, Girl, she sees this exact same selfie angle in like 30 million photos. <laughs> she still looks really cute though, so I can't complain too much. And then Wendy also looks really cute. And then there's another set of the exact same cards, but then these ones have signatures and a little message on the back. I'm confused by this, I'll be real. I don't know, like, should we put both sets in our binder? Like, why did they... Why? Maybe they wanted you to have one for the back of the phone, but I mean, I'll show you the difference. It's just, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. Very odd choices that SM did. I would have taken another set of cards, like would have loved another set of selfies for sure, but I don't know. SM's been weird <laughs> as of late. Um, <laughs> anyway, I, something tells me that this is all I'm gonna be able to fit into one haul video. So yeah, <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed seeing me unbox Red Velvet's fan club. Honestly, I'm pretty happy about it. I'm not, I'm not as excited as I wanted to be just because I did want a new photo shoot and that would have been like the greatest gift to Revel Ups, but like, or even like old backstage photos of the girls in eras through the years. Like I would have gotten so emotional. I honestly think this was a missed chance. They could have given us photos from every era from debut to now and it would have made us super emotional and super ready for Red Velvet's comeback and like we would have been all nostalgic and shit but like I don't know I guess they decided to go for like just like I don't know I think this could have been better curated but I'm happy that the photo cards are still very cute happy about the pin and I'm also really happy about so many of these things like completing one's album card collection, the red room pin, the Luna light stick, like that's so exciting. So yeah, <laughs> I hope y'all are doing well. I hope um, you've been okay. I'm sorry, I feel like I've been taking it like a little bit of a distance from the channel just because my life has gotten super hectic and I have a lot of stuff to do and I need to prioritize some other things for a while, but Thank you still for watching this channel. I'm super grateful to everyone who watches. Thank you so much for your support. And yeah, I hope y'all are doing well. Hope you're staying safe. Have a lovely week, an amazing day, and I will see you next time. Bye.